A home is where you live, your innate soul belongs to. It's a place you long to come back to as that's the extent you relate yourself to your home. No matter whether it's your own or on rent, small or a big one, it's you who turn that house into a home by decorating and maintaining. You know the unorganized and unmaintained home can cost you more than just your inner peace. If you don't have a proper home for all your belongings, then you will always spend a lot of time searching for things which you need urgently. Hello everyone, this is Priyanka and once again welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I am going to talk about some areas which we usually miss out thinking that it is not important and it can be taken care of later. Today's video is in collaboration with Live Pure Smart and I had few good reasons why I decided to go ahead with it. In the contest, I'll show you some ideas if you're living on rent. So let's get started. You must have seen this wall art in many of my previous videos and you had asked me where I got this from. So in fact, this is a DIY wall art. It's a tablecloth which I have as wall art. For this, you need to have an old painting or you can also get a frame made from a local carpenter or if you want, you can also make it on your own by getting the molds from a local hardware shop and just make a frame of the size you want. Now leave it to your creativity how you can use it. I had used a tablecloth and a runner earlier which I got a long time back from Suraj Kun Fair. Frame this cloth on the wood with the help of nails. You can also use furniture staple. I would suggest to go for furniture stapler because whenever you need to change the fabric, it can be easily removed compared to the nails. Now, this was tablecloth, but you can also buy any good looking dupatta or any fabric of your choice. Like few months back, I got these fabrics from the market. Simply put it over the frame or on the old painting. Stretch it from the sides and use nails at the back to secure it. And voila, your wall art is ready. Sometimes thinking a little outside of the box can give you many ideas to turn very ordinary things into a masterpiece for yourself. This wall art has been with me for 2-3 to three years and of course you have seen it many times in many of my makeover videos also. Recently, a friend of mine has shifted to a new rented home and there were two things she asked me. First, she wanted to change the look of the wall without spending too much money. The answer is a simple one. Go for self-adhesive wallpaper, which is not very costly and you can get it easily online. The best thing is in case you again want to change the look, just apply another wallpaper over it without peeling it off from the wall. And second, she said in my previous rented home, there was already a water purifier installed, but in this new one, I don't have. So I have to buy a new one now. So here comes Live Pure Smart for the rescue. Recently, Live Pure Smart has contacted me and told me about this unique feature where you don't have to buy the whole new machine. Any good RO in the market will cost you around 15 to 20,000 rupees with the annual maintenance cost of rupees 4 to 5,000. Here, I want to introduce the unique feature of Live Pure Smart, where you can rent this machine for free. Pay zero cost for the machine and simply use it. This purifies the water with its advanced six-stage water purification. This machine comes with a smart technology where you can monitor your water consumption with their Live Pure Smart app, which is available on both iOS and Android. Here, you can see how much water you have consumed how is your machine working? You can check the filter life and your daily consumption of the water. You don't have to call when you need to raise a complaint. In the app only, you get this option to raise the complaint. When I say it's a very nice solution, especially for renters, where you get free relocation services with LiftPure Smart gets it reinstalled free of cost. Their services are currently available in 20 cities. For more info, you can check their website as well. The machine which was delivered to my place is Live Pure NV Plus and in this you get one more option of Live Pure Smart Bolt. The installation person came to install it for the free. 
They have two plans, limited water for Rs 375 per month and unlimited water for Rs 525 per month. When you rent this machine, you have to pay Rs 1,499 rupees as a security deposit, which is completely refundable once you stop using their services. All the details about LiftPure Smart is provided below in the description box. Just a quick fix for those who love to have lights in their crockery unit or in a TV unit. You can use these LEDs under the shelf lights, which comes with adhesive and can be easily fixed under the shelf. I like these because they are USB compilant and so better than the other battery operated lights where you have to change batteries very frequently. It has two modes. When you put it on auto mode, it will sense and switch on the lights. It also has on and off mode, which means when you need to switch on the light, just slide the button towards on and your light will glow. One of the easiest and budget friendly ways to have a spotlight in your crockery unit. How do you remove nails from the walls? When you do so, a big portion around the nail also comes off and then you have to fill that space with putti. Let me tell you an easier way to do so. Take masking tape and apply it across the nail like this. Now pull the nail very gently from the wall with the help of a hammer or a plier. Now let's remove the tape from the wall and see there is no extra plaster across the nails coming out. Hence, no fix needed later on. If you really need it clean, you can still apply a little portion of putti just on the hole and that's it. Again, a small thing but very useful. Some of your friends have asked me before about what should be used to write over these chalkboard labels. You can surely buy those glass markers specifically made for them. But I have a workaround for you. You can simply use a white pencil color or a white crayon can also do the job. When you need to alter these labels, you can simply use a normal pencil eraser and write what you intended. Economical, yet feasible and equally effective. Recently, one of you asked how to take care of combs in monsoon when weather is very sticky and always humid. To clean a comb, it's still the old good trick that we all know. Simply take water and add shampoo, mix it and immerse all your comb into this for around 10 to 20 minutes. To clean such combs, you can take a toothpick or you can also take a U-pin like this and slide it across the space which is in between the bristles several times to remove the whole bunch from here and then immerse it in water and soap solution to nicely clean it. Now take them out and use a brush to clean it and see how dirty the water is now. Keep it in sun to get it completely dry. In our homes, we often have power sockets very close to the floor which makes them difficult to use, especially for charging phones. When you put it on for charging, you happen to put it on floor and someone might step over it by mistake. To avoid this, you can put two command hooks right over the switch port like this. Plug in your adapter and wrap the excess wire around it. Now put your phone over these hooks for charging. Simple enough to be used effectively for charging your phones and handheld devices. I'm sure you have faced this problem that when you slide your curtains to open them or to close, they won't slide gently. And then you have to do it forcefully to shift the curtains. Especially if you have two curtain rods, then the eyelet portion of the curtains tussle with each other and make it difficult to slide. So for this you can use a scotch tape. Scotch tape has a very smooth surface unlike the masking tape and the plastic packaging tapes which we usually use. 
Put the tape on the rod and then put the curtains on it. Now since the scotch tape has a very smooth surface which makes the curtains glide very easily over it. Give it a try and let me know. This hack could be more useful in the monsoon. In monsoon, it's kind of irritating to always see the bathroom floor wet. The area which is supposed to remain dry also becomes very wet because of such bathroom mats which we usually use. So if you have a small bathroom or you are on rent where you can't do much, just use a water absorbent bathroom mat. This mat is from Amazon and you can find the link below in the description box. You can keep it just outside your bathing area so that whenever you come out from the shower, just wipe your feet and come out. This will magically absorb the water in no time and it also keeps the mat dry. This way your bathroom will not smell all musty and it will also keep the area dry. This is all for today's video and I really hope you are going to find all these ideas useful. If you like today's video, then please do share this video with all your friends and family, like the video and please do subscribe to my channel. You can also follow us on Instagram and Facebook for more video related updates. All the details about Lift Pure Smart is given below in the description box. If you are on rent and you are looking for a good water purifier in a budget range, then Lift Pure Smart is for you. I'll see you next time with another video. Till then, stay home, take care and bye-bye.